If there's one dish I love ordering at a Hong Kong style cafe, it has to be Ha Dao Si, also known as Hong Kong style shrimp toast. Get ready to buy five boxes of shrimp because once you try this recipe, you'll be making it every day for the rest of the week. Let's get started. Start by mincing the garlic. Do the same for the ginger. Now, finally chop the green onions. For the cilantro, only use the head. Then, finally chop as well. Make sure that the shrimp is completely dry before mincing. I like to pet dry with a paper towel, wrap it, and then refrigerate it again to make it more dry. You also want the shrimp to be cold to ensure the mixture sticks together, so doing this will further help. Flatten the shrimp first, then lightly chop. Once everything is done, place it back onto the cutting board and use the back of the knife to mince just a little bit more. Feel free to use a food processor if you have one, but if not, a cleaver works just fine. Now we can mix everything together. Add your chopped ingredients, then add sugar, light soy sauce, fish sauce, cornstarch, a little black pepper, and one egg white. Mix well and refrigerate for a minimum of 20 minutes. For the bread, it's best to cut off the crust. Let's also prepare the breading. Just a little bit of sesame seeds and a little bit of breadcrumbs. After 20 minutes, we can spread the shrimp onto the bread. Make sure to spread just a thin layer, otherwise it might not cook through. Now dip the top into the breading. Then, immediately deep fry on medium heat. Turn over once cooked in golden brown, then deep fry the bottom. Strain out all the oil before serving. This dish is already amazing on its own, but if you like, you can serve it with some sweet and sour sauce as well. You can find the recipe in the description box below. I can't stop eating this. If you enjoyed today's video, click here to watch last week's video, or click here to watch a video that I handpicked just for you.